This video will cover the topic polynomial long division problem type 1. Suppose we want to divide the polynomial 3x squared plus 13x plus 9 by the binomial x plus 3. There's more than one way to do this, but in this video we'll be focusing on polynomial long division. Using this method we can divide any two polynomials. Let's break it down. First, let's organize our work by writing this expression as a typical long division problem. With the dividend, the polynomial being divided, underneath the long division symbol, and the divisor, the number that divides the dividend, to the left. It's important that the polynomials are both listed with higher order terms first, meaning the terms with higher exponents should come before those with lower exponents. In this example, they're both already listed this way. Next, we'll focus on the highest order term of both polynomials, 3x squared and x. What is 3x squared divided by x? Well, if we divide 3x squared by x, the result is 3x. Right. So we'll write 3x above our long division symbol. Now we'll multiply 3x and x plus 3 and write the answer 3x squared plus 9x below the first two terms in the dividend. Next we'll subtract 3x squared plus 9x from the polynomial under the long division symbol. And when we do that subtraction, we see that 3x squared minus 3x squared is 0. 13x minus positive 9x is 4x. And nothing is subtracted from 9, so that just stays the same. We have plus 9 here. So at this step, our result is 4x plus 9. That seems similar to regular long division. Exactly. We are doing long division, but with polynomials, so the procedures are very similar. To continue the problem, we'll repeat the first step, but this time we'll divide 4x by x. Okay, 4x divided by x is 4. Awesome. So let's write plus 4 above the long division symbol. Now do we multiply plus 4 times the quantity x plus 3 and subtract that product from the polynomial under the long division symbol, similar to what we did before? Correct. Okay, 4 times the quantity x plus 3 equals 4x plus 12. And when we subtract that, we're left with 0 minus 3. But what do we do now? We can't divide negative 3 by x. Right, so since we can't go any further, 3x plus 4 is our answer, and negative 3 is our remainder. So, to divide a polynomial by another using polynomial long division, we first organize our work like a typical long division problem. After that, we divide the first term of the dividend by the first term of the divisor, write that term above the long division symbol, subtract the product of that term and the divisor from the dividend, and then repeat until we're left with the remainder. You got it. <laughs> 